Marissa Powers at University Transfer. They're pretty good, but I would say they should have stuff like this, like the breakfast stuff, like stuff like that at lunch, because they don't really make many things fresh. Like they'll have like the like the burgers and the wings and stuff like that, but those are like made, and then they're out for the rest of the lunch. The stuff they make for you right there on the spot. So I feel like stuff like that should be more emphasized here, rather than like Mr. Sub or Teriyaki. But I mean, I'm not saying they shouldn't have those things, but they should have more um, more variety in terms of food that's actually made in front of you, and you can see it hasn't been sitting there for a few hours. Uh, I would say, compared to the universities that I have been to, um, this is more lower end. Just because there's not as many fresh things, right? More things are sitting around. They should be more uh, priced accordingly to like a student's budget. Like We need to understand that students don't have $8 to spend on a smoothie all the time. For a lunch, I would say it shouldn't be more than six or seven bucks. I've seen students pay over 10 bucks to have lunch here, which I think is ridiculous. Because, I mean, we're not stupid, we're not in high school anymore. We know that it comes down to a profit. So if we see that students are spending over 10 bucks on a lunch, we know that that goes to the school. So I just get a soup. I get a soup like once a week because on Tuesdays, that's when they have like the good soup. And that's pretty much it. I would say bring your lunch to school most of the time, unless you want to go for it.